A wonky horizon in drone footage can ruin that footage. Did you know that you can fix it whilst you're up there? Let's show you how. Hi, I'm Ashton Droning on, and a few videos ago, we published a tutorial on how to fix a wonky horizon in your video footage that you've captured with a drone. Now, whilst it is possible to fix it in post editing, did you know that older drones such as the Mavic 2, even the old Phantom, let you correct a wonky horizon whilst you're up there flying? The benefit of fixing it whilst you're flying, of course, is you don't then need to fix it in post editing, and that saves you a lot of time and effort. It also means that you don't lose that critical resolution from your image that you will lose when you try and fix this in post editing. It's very easy and we'll show you how to do it now. If you find breaking news and tutorials like this interesting, then smash that subscribe button below so that you don't miss the next one. Enjoy. So here outside on a lovely day, and I've got the Mavic 2 Pro, one of my favorite drones still. I do actually prefer it to the Mavic Air 2. It's just bigger, it feels more robust and far more capable in my opinion. But what I'm gonna do is show you today how to fix a dodgy horizon at the time of flying. So you don't need to do it in post editing. So let's take off first of all. Up we go. Let's get recording as well, why not? So we're recording and up we go. So immediately, as soon as we've taken off there, you can see that our horizon is quite wonky. And I'm just actually gonna hover there because we've got a nice area here to test. Beautiful imagery as well. And if I just flick to the actual 4K footage from that drone, you can see just how pretty the footage is straight off the Mavic 2 Pro with no editing or post-production or color grading at all. So we can see that the horizon is quite clearly off. Now we can fix that in post editing if we want via tools such as Adobe Premiere, but we don't want to do that. We want to fix it right now. The way we do it, if you click the little three dots in the top right hand corner, you get to the main menu. From that point, you can now press a little gimbal button just at the bottom on the left hand side and then press the option to adjust gimbal. And you'll see that what that's done is introduce a little prompt down there with roll and yaw. So we can adjust the roll, the yaw from this, and you can see it's already set to 3.5, which I've used as an example to show how offset it can actually be. Now you may not be too clear on where the horizon should be, but you'll notice in the middle, we've got a crosshair, which is there by standard, and we can use that to fix the wonky horizon. So I'm now gonna press the left-hand side. You can't press and hold it, unfortunately. You have to keep tapping it, but I'm gonna keep tapping it until our horizon looks nice and level which is about there. And what that's actually doing is mechanically rotating or rolling the gimbal to fix that dodgy horizon. And as you can now see, we have a perfect horizon. So if I start to ascend here, it all looks absolutely lovely. So it's that simple to fix the horizon mechanically, and it means we don't have to do anything in post-production. However, having said that, if we now start to put this into Premiere and notice that it is still a little bit wonky, you've still got the option to correct it. Now, as I ascend up here, you can see that actually, now that the real horizon is clear, that actually we still need to fix that a little bit more. So I'm gonna roll it a little bit to the right, and now we've got it absolutely perfect. So there you go, it wasn't that simple. Next time you're up there flying your Phantom 2 or any other drone that uses the older DJI app, be sure to adjust your horizon mechanically because as mentioned earlier, you won't lose valuable resolution and it will save you a ton of time in post-edit. Comment below if this video has just helped you to fix a wonky horizon and also be sure to check out our other tutorial which shows you how to fix a wonky horizon in post-editing such as Adobe Premiere and DaVinci Resolve because sometimes you may not notice a wonky horizon until you review the footage afterwards. Give this video a thumbs up or a thumbs down if you've got a wonky face. And of course, smash that subscribe button. Thank you very much for watching.